In this video, we're going to see how to create a quiz from a Google Sheet. So here I have a quiz, uh, Google Sheet. I'll just open. And as we can see here, we have quiz name. I'm going to say Geo Quiz. And I have questions, four choices. And the fourth one is always the correct answer. That's how we enter other choices type of question this is short answer this is multiple choice and there is a small description that we will write uh, below every question number of marks for each question correct question and which quiz is, is it added to so this column will become clear to you once you see the implementation so here we have the questions and now let me just go ahead and click on quiz menu here as we can see we have four options 5 quiz, 10 quiz, 20 and 50 and uh, we have two more options calculate square and email square. So let me go ahead and create a quiz here. So I'll go to quiz menu and click on create 5 quiz. Once I do that it says running script. Script. Go here to the 4 quiz 33 and here as well we have the link uh, automatically added to this same quiz 33 name is geo quiz and we have the questions as you can see uh, which continent is known as the land down under is in quiz 33 which continent and this is a type of short answer question so it says write the answer which is coming from this and now we can see these are multiple choice questions because we have mentioned as multiple choice and this is the comment select the right choice i noticed there is a spelling mistake which i don't think we should correct it okay so now i'm going to send this link over uh, the person who is taking the quiz right and I would ask them to take the quiz. So, for example, this is the person and they have logged in with their Gmail ID. And this is their email ID and their name. And now the answers land down under the correct answer is always in the e column so i copy this and i paste it which mountain range is located in south america and this is the correct answer so i'll score that and here again and rest of the two questions i'm going to give the wrong answers i know the answer here is sahara and this is not himalaya right so I know that I'll score three marks in this. So once I submit this, your response has been recorded. And now we were in the geo quiz and the geo quiz is quiz number 33. So I go to the sheet called 33 and I can see that this person, John has taken the test and he has given me these answers, right? And uh, this is the last question. So now I go ahead and suppose I got a couple of responses. I want to go here and say calculate scores. So what's going to happen is in the score column, it's going to calculate. Now we know that this question, we have given three correct answers. So when we do calculate scores, our score is automatically coming as three out of five. Now we want to tell this person that you know send them an email of the scores now i go ahead and select this and what this is going to do is this is going to send them an email with a certificate of uh, their score so if i go to that email id i can see there is a certificate of participation that i have just received and as you can see congratulations John, so it's printed only J, I'm going to fix that. You're participating in the quiz and you have scored 3 out of 5. 
Now this J is coming because I know why it's coming. I'm going to fix it. Um, so there you go. Uh, it was a small demo of how this system works. Let me go ahead and fix it. Uh, that problem we have. Congratulations. And here, name and name in. The name in is coming from here, student name. And the student name is, we just have to remove this, right? So now it is fine. So let me go ahead and as we can see here, I'm going to delete this. Now they have uh, submitted their uh, answers, but let's go ahead and uh, send them the score. So the moment I click on this, it's going to run the script. And once the script is stopped finishing, finished uh, running, uh, let's go back to the email of the person. And if we refresh it, we can see there's an email called certificate of participation and the first name underscore quiz name and says congratulations please find your certificate attached and once you click on it it says certificate of participation congratulations john for participating in the quiz number 33 okay uh, you have scored three out of five so that is the whole this thing and let us take a little bit of help from chat gpt let me bring in ChatGPT over here, and I'm going to ask ChatGPT, uh, please give me ten. Let me go with five. Five questions for a quiz. It will be general knowledge related to geography. The questions should have four answers. The Please give me the questions and answers in a table format so that I can easily copy and paste it into a spreadsheet. Also put the correct answer for every question as the last choice. Now let's see how ChatGPT is going to solve this question. So it says, what is the largest ocean? and Um, what is the correct answer? Okay, Pacific. Okay. Uh, I don't like it's printing A, B, C, D. So let me just request. Thanks. That's great. Uh, but please remove A dot B dot etc. from the choices so let's see if it understands yeah so it's able to give i can maybe copy the whole thing and let me paste it here see what happens okay great that's great now i'm going to delete this row i'm going to format copy this and format these and now I'm going to delete these rows. So we have our questions. These are the correct answers. Now I want two of them as short answer and three of them as multiple choice. And the, the comment I will have for the students is, you know, say correct 
as a correct choice. And I'll copy that and let me go ahead and limit this. Scores I'll say one each and that should be good enough for us to create our quiz. So this way we can go ahead and create quizzes and share it with people and send them a certificate when they are done. That's the way we can uh, create a quiz and share it with people. Let me just take this quiz as well. So I'll go here and I'll take the new quiz just to test it. It's a wonderful solution to create quizzes and share with people and create some contest and whatnot. Thank you so much for uh, watching the video and uh, if you want the solution to this just to go to uh, just go to sheetsprojects.com and if you go to products uh, there are many free projects uh, here so you'll be able to see them and as well as this project will be put here so if you want uh, this project then please go ahead and uh, Click on the link if you want it and once you click on the link you can just check this checkbox and uh, get access. Some of them are custom pricing so you have to go to choose your own price kind of project. Um, then you can go here you can see the demo and you can just fill your name and details and say submit a custom price request. You get an email and we can take it from there. Thank you so much for watching the video and I hope you have a great day.